backstage of the, uh, of the rose room in the bathroom, and that's a little residue of Crystal's panties right there. And she just took off what she was wearing. Right Anyways, we're about to start our interview with Edna Jean Robinson, a.k.a. Richard Curtin. Yeah. And welcome to another installment of the Toilet Interviews <laughs> right here at the Rose Room. This is Just Keep Breathing for RationalBroadcasting.com. I'm Richard Curtin. And I'm with... I'm with... Do you want me to call you Tammy or Tammy. Terry? Tammy. Do you have to stand so tall and talk? Okay. This is Tammy with Lacage Au Fall. Hi, everyone. What's up, y'all? Tammy from Lacage. That's me. Tammy or Terry? Tammy and Terry, but Tammy Lavelle. Tammy, Tammy Lavelle. Tammy Lavelle. That's me. TT. I like TT. That's like Tranny Tammy. Tranny Tammy. No. no. You know Tranny words. Tammy? No Tranny. Okay. No Tranny words. No Tranny. I, I used to. Back, back to the interview. Back, back, to, the back, interview. back, back to the interview. Back, back, back. Sorry, girl. Give, Sorry, girl. Give, 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 give us a little tea about George Hamilton. Oh, you know what? Honestly, here's the tea about George Hamilton. Every single person consistently asks us something and seriously wants everybody to say something bad or whatever, but I'm going to tell you something really true about this man. The most consistent performer I've ever worked with and a sweetheart, just a genuine, kind, and I'm not just saying it because it's an interview. I'm not. I'm telling the truth. He is a great, spirited, great-hearted, and just a good guy and a good friend. Loves his company and loves his work ethic, and I love that. Anybody who loves the work ethic, especially coming from television and film, you respect them even more because being in theater, it's hard. You know, we theater and television kind of two different things, but he came over to theater and is just working just as hard as we're working. So we actually love him. And, you know, he's got a really great reputation. And, um, and, and in the gay community, we really yes. love him, too. We do. We do. And he's a, he's a, he supports us, though. So we find these times, like, George is like, right now we're doing um, promotions for Broadway Cares, Equity Fights, AIDS. And we're doing a, a book giveaway where we have George Hamilton's book. And if you give $300, you get to get his book, sign his autograph, take pictures and stuff. And he's, like, there until the last person. So if you come sign an autograph, he's very kind. He's, like, never pompous about anything. He's just like, I'll sign, whatever. Takes his time. He's a great guy. I really. And um, who are you in Lacage? I play Mercedes, and I, I would call myself probably the one who's the older one of the group, the wise girl, the mature girl, the one who's been there a long time, and the one who probably would step in for Zaza. Ooh, she's gonna be mad that I said that, but I don't care. <laughs> so you're the you're the Erica Andrews of Lacage. Andrews of Lacage. Yes. Okay. Thank you, Mama. Lakaj <laughs> at Fair Park. Fair Park. And here we are, rationalbroadcasting.com with Terry from Lakaj. Love you guys. Come Give us a little quick little sample of your voice. Born this way. And we can find you on YouTube under. You can find my single on YouTube, um, Amazon.com iTunes.com, everything. It's Born This Way. It was written and produced by Ashford and Simpson, Born friends of mine. So. We love you. Thank you. Just love keep you breathing. Irrationalbroadcasting.com. Thank you. Yes. Bye. Bye. Bye.